Hey YouTube, it's Monique. Welcome back to my channel. I know you guys are like, what's going on? What is this? I thought it was a plan with me. It is a plan with me. So let me explain. This is from Simply Gilded. I actually, let me move all of this stuff. Let me just show you this washi because I'm not gonna get, I wanna use it for this kit that I'm gonna be using and I haven't hauled it yet. So this is gonna be my haul of this stuff from Simply Gilded. So I got this beautiful journaling card. It says, a new day, a fresh start, awaken to a full heart. And that is in rose gold and this is absolutely gorgeous, like gorgeous. And this is like a really good sturdy piece of cardstock. And this is what the packaging looks like. And lately, Irene's orders have been coming with this little bow sticker, which I think it is so adorable. So I have quite a few of those now, not complaining, love them. And I ordered this light pink washi with silver bows. So I have the regular size and then the skinny washi which I think is stunning. So there you have it. I just wanted to make, oops, sorry. I just wanted to make sure I officially hauled it so you guys can see what it looks like. So this is my CAD binder that I usually don't use. Um, I have my CAD stickers in a two inch black mini binder that that's where I keep my CAD stickers just so I can have them all in the same place because you can't fit that much in these binders. So that is where it is. So what I have put in here and what I did order from Scribble Prints were her date stickers. And I did like the concept of you just organizing your kits. So that's basically um, what I did. Um, so I got this idea from Andrea. So I organized my kit. So the kit that I'm using for next week is this one. So for now, I just put the posters there, which work just as well as the stickers. I mean, hello, if I would have known. My um, CAD binder is signed by Christy Ann or Kristen herself. So that's what you guys are seeing up in that corner. So anyway, I just wanted to show you guys my little setup and I'm using this kit from Jameson Reed that I got last year. So it's called Staying In. And I figured since I was having a sleepover on New Year's Eve for um, How Do You Get Away With Murder um, marathon, I would use this kit. Cause I was like, oh, this kit is perfect. So it's absolutely gorgeous. Again, I got it last year and I just never had an opportunity to really use it until now, so I'm going to use it. And I know her format has changed just a tiny little bit. So this is my traveler's notebook. Okay, so hopefully that's better. Anyway, it's my traveler's notebook and I'll just show you guys last week, which today is Friday, so this is where we are. Again, this kit is from Little Miss Papery. So there you have it, and there is my flap. Yep, I only put out one video this week, so yep, that's it. So loving that so far, I'm going to close this baby up because I'm starting some new inserts still from Jacenia's principles. It's just that it's a different format. So this is the three week a uh, three week. This is the one week on three page with lists. So we have your sidebar, your Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, and then we have Saturday, Sunday, happy thought, next week, notes, priorities to do, don't forget, and work to do. So that's what I have. Um yeah, so this is my first time planning in these and I'm super excited. So I am going to do these as a voiceover. I just think that it makes perfect sense to do it that way. And I was very comfortable with that setup last week because 
<laughs> before the video went like 40 minutes and I was like so embarrassed about it. But anyway guys, sit back, relax, and enjoy the video. Okay guys, so now I am laying down the date dots for the date covers. And I'm using, again, this kit is from Jameson Reed. And um, I got it last year. And I'm super excited to be using it. So again, I'm just laying down these date covers. And the first two pages have Monday through Friday. And then I'm turning over to do Saturday through Sunday. So, and now I am sizing up that double box and laying it down. I really wanted to make sure that I used it in this spread. It is very pretty. And now I'm laying down the to-do headers because I've decided to start from the top because normally um, I start from the bottom, but this time I wanted to start from the top. And I'm sorry that I pushed the page kind of all the way up because then you guys can't really see the top of the page i'm sorry i'll have to make sure in the future that i'm in frame a little better anyway i'm sorry guys if you can hear fireworks or gunshots and yes i said gunshots in the background because it is new year's eve um but i had to get this done people anyway i am now using these three heart half boxes so they're not quite square they're rounded like normal half boxes but i decided to use those because again on the weekend i don't need a full to-do list so now i am laying down the full pattern um check heart to-do list and i'm just doing that from monday through friday and i thought these were so pretty so i'm just alternating the dark outline from the lighter outline ones and now I'm putting in a full box on the sidebar and then I'm adding this little girl for some deco because I didn't have anything that said anything in one of the boxes like a quote so I decided to add that and then I added the this week sticker so now at the bottom I'm adding the simply gilded washi that I just hauled in the beginning of this video it is the light pink with the silver foil and I think that it matched this kit absolutely perfectly. It is so pretty. Sorry, my focusing issues. I don't know what's going on, but yeah. So I cut down a full box. Chuck, uh, I cut down a heart checklist box to do my cleaning list for the week. And I used a to clean header. So now I'm just checking my zones to make sure I have the right areas that I'm recording there and putting that in and then I will continue with the sidebar and now I'm adding in a box for my videos I cut it down because um, for the new year I'm going to try to stick to a pretty good schedule so I already have videos scheduled so hopefully everything goes well and um, things are out on time so yeah just searching for that Coffee Monsters Co. YouTube play button and now I'm just writing YouTube in. So now I'm going to add my today headers. So I'm putting those in and I realized, I don't know, I don't really know if I like the way that looks. I think it looks so crowded. I mean, I, I did leave it. I did not change it, but like, I just don't know if that's something that I'll do next time. I think I need to break that up. I'm not sure. Maybe with a different design, it would have looked differently to me, but I don't know. But I still went with it. So now I'm just adding my day off sticker because that is New Year's Day. So I'm off from work. The children are off this entire week and the following Monday. Can you believe that, guys? It's like so annoying. It really is. But just like my school age kids, my daycare kid goes back on Tuesday goodness so now I'm also adding in that, that we are continuing our how do you get away with murder marathon and actually 
since I'm filming this video on New Year's Eve, I will let y'all know we didn't even start yet. So we'll probably just spend that whole day watching that. I added that little popcorn sticker that is from um, Chrissy Ann Design. So I just thought I'd add that in. And I think that little TV is from Once More With Love. So that is not from Jameson Reed as well. And that winter break sticker is from Lexi Kylie as well as that day off sticker. Because I don't think I even said that. Well, I added the little house sticker that is from Libby & Co. Because I will be working from home on Friday. Because I'm going to get back to my regular scheduled program. Adding in these work stickers. These are from Libby & Co. And they are a transparent background. And I absolutely love them. Use them to put my work schedule in. And I absolutely love this. I did this in my hourly. But um, now I have found it useful to add it into the B6. So this is great. And since I'm not using my hourly anymore, I do need to have my work schedule in my planner. So I can visualize my day. I'm adding a bill due sticker. So I need to pay daycare on Friday. My paydays are different um, for 2018. So I have to kind of pay attention to those. And I'm just adding a plan sticker with a little gem pen to go with the planner. And then the garbage day on, I believe that is Wednesday evening. So we know to put the garbage out. And I put this um, little thing labeled down here. I'm looking for a open book from Christian Designs because I'm going to put down that I have Bible study. So I'm going to add that in there. And now we are on Saturday and I'm adding a half box to put in the Sabbath service scriptures. So I'm just adding that in as I look up the scriptures because, you know, I can't be prepared properly. <laughs> anyway, I'm just adding that in. This comes in so helpful during service. I referenced this a few times. I'm adding a full box to Sunday and using the um, makeup brushes, that um, little icon that came with the thing to remind me to wash my makeup brushes. Since I'm back to work, I'm going to need to wash my brushes at the end of the week. And then Simply Gilded Washi again at the bottom, just trying to complete that off. I love how well the skinny washi fit at the bottom. So now I'm figuring out how to label, how to put this um, weekly tracker in and I'm using this for dinners so I was able to figure something out and then I'm using some of the sticker washi from the kit to fill in that space there so then I'm using my exacto knife to cut it and then pretty soon I'm going to fill in dinners in the little header spot so I really really like that And now in that happy thought box, I put that sticker there that says make time for yourself. So that's kind of why I added it there. And then I added the woke up like this hashtag flawless to the box below just to put some deco there. And I added this little scale from Christy Ann Designs because I am going to be back on my weight loss journey. It is quite serious. And these little bows are from Clever Girl Crafts. And I think they were so cute, even though they're gold foil. And then I added some more of the Simply Gilded Washi. So, the guys, that completes the spread. So, I'm just going to keep these note pages real simple right now until I figure out, like, how I want to do it. But I'm going to show you guys, again, my Monday through Friday plus the sidebar. So that's how it all looks. And again, sorry that it wasn't like completely in frame, but you guys can pretty much see the whole spread. So guys, thank you so much for watching and I hope to see you in the next video. Bye.